Hi, my name is Melissa Whitmer. I'm the creator of the Ultimate Athlete Project, and today I'm going to demonstrate uh, a pike push-up, or maybe called a bear crawl push-up. The reason we are doing this is um, so I've you know looked all over the internet for uh, for pulling exercises uh, that are body weight that do not involve a pull-up bar. Uh, as you can imagine, this is a bit difficult, and I really haven't found anything that I like. So um, what we're doing with this exercise is this exercise is a way to target our lats and if you think about it it's going to be the opposite, think about it as the opposite of a lat pull down. Okay? So this is going to be an overhead motion. If you have trouble with overhead motions this might not be the right exercise for you. Okay? So we're just thinking about a lat pull down but we're thinking about um, instead of pulling down we're going to be um, lowering ourselves. So we're gonna, instead of um, contracting the lats concentrically, we're going to be um, contracting the lats eccentrically um, as we are lowering ourselves down. <clears throat> okay, so you're gonna get the best benefit of this exercise by doing it slowly on the way down. And um, yeah, okay, so that's what it is and why we're doing it. So we we'll should demonstrate what it looks like. You want to um, be on all fours. Your heels are going to be off the ground and your butt is going to be up. Okay, so I'm kind of a little bit in downward facing dog. Uh, I, you can see the important part, which is my hands. And trying to make a straight line between my, the top of my head, trying to make a straight line between the top of my head and the back of my spine. And then I want to be in a pretty high pike, so I'm going to try to get my arms and legs close together and then I'm going to lower myself down, okay? So here we are. And then your stance is going to be a little wider than shoulder width. So again, think about a lat pull down. Okay. If you keep that lat pull down motion in mind, that should be a helpful cue. Okay. So I hope you enjoy that exercise uh, and uh, give it a go and let me know what you think.